what is up you guys welcome back to my channel I have a big bag of stuff here because I'm a psychopath and I don't know how to control myself when I get a paycheck moving on so <laughs> I went shopping I got a couple of things from Ulta um, some stuff on the Estee Lauder website um, some Bath and Body Work stuff <laughs> um, so I'm just gonna kind of go through and show you guys what I bought what I'm excited about etc. So let's just go ahead and jump on into it. I'm going to dive into this bag here because there's so much crap. So I just uh, stocked up on my Girl Techniques Beauty Sponge because this is my favorite sponge in life to apply my foundation. I also got the Makeup Revolution, Makeup Revolution Soap X 24 Oh my god, I hate myself. The 24 Ultra Professional Eyeshadow Palette. Um, this is what the Unicarton looks like. Really pretty. And then the palette. This is what the inside looks like. I've heard pretty good things about this palette, which is why I wanted to try it out. I mean, the colors in here look gorgeous. So I'm excited to try this out. I think this was like $15, so. We'll see how it works. Also got the Flower Beauty Light Illusion Full Coverage Concealer. I've heard great things about this, so I'm excited to try it out. I also got on the Estee Lauder website the Estee Lauder Double Wear Stay in Place Flawless Wear Concealer. I got it in the shade Extra Light Neutral or 1N. Sorry. This is what it looks like. I want to try this out. I'm excited. I've heard good things about this, so I'm excited to try it out a little doe foot applicator so we'll see how that works out and then i also got on estee lauder the double wear light stand place makeup i have the original um double wear stand place makeup the full coverage one that will literally cover your entire life and all your secrets so i wanted to try the light one because the more I wear makeup, the more like natural I want to be. I'm not really going for the full coverage cake face look anymore. So I wanted to try the light one out. It's supposed to last 15 hours. It's for all skin types. So I really wanted to try it out. I got the shade Intensity 1.0. The shade range wasn't phenomenal. Um, there was one shade lighter than this. And I think this won't match me at my lightest. So I might need to go with that lighter shade. Um, but I'm going to do a first impression wear test on this foundation, so look for that coming soon. What else did we get? I got the NYX Epic Ink Liner. This is one of my favorite um, liquid eyeliners. It, it lasted me a pretty long time, and it just gives me that perfect wing when I decide I ever want to do one. I never do, so. Oh my gosh, I got another concealer. Why did I do this? <laughs> I got... Um, the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer in the shade Light. I think I need to go back and get the shade Fair because it's a little darker than I thought. But I've tried this concealer. I really like it. I've heard it's a dupe for the NARS Radiant Creamy Concealer something. But I've never tried that one, so I couldn't speak on it. I also got the Wet n Wild Mega Cushion Foundation. It has SPF 15 contains natural coconut derivative Ooh. luminous lightweight and buildable hydrating formula so I'm excited to try this because that sounds exactly what I like in foundation so this is what it looks like so I'm excited to try this one out I might do a foundation review on that one as well but I'm gonna do the Estee Lauder one first I do have this on my face today so but I'm not saying anything. You need to watch the video. Um, I also got the Wet n Wild Rosie in the Air palette. I wanted to compare this to the uh, Modern Renaissance Anastasia Beverly Hills palette. So I'm going to do a video comparing these two. I do have these on my eyes today. Can you tell which one is which? Bet you can't. What else do we have in this box of goodies? Oh, I 
I got this little lipstick from Marshalls. It's from Too Faced. It's a little baby mini size, but it was like four bucks. And it's in the shade Naked Dolly. So it's like a pretty nude lipstick. So I wanted to try that out. I'm more of a nude lip girl. If I'm ever wearing a lip product, it's a nude lip or a nude gloss. So. All right, so, so when I purchased the Estee Lauder crap, I they were doing, that's where I got this bag that I have all this stuff in. It's from Estee Lauder. They sent it with a couple of different, um, like if you spent like $45 or something, you get this bag and then um, a couple of like different samples that you could choose from. So I didn't even see what I got yet. So it looks like this is a lip conditioner. Coda's interested in this. Coda. You like Estee Lauder? Do you want that? No. Can't have it. You can't have it. Um doesn't smell like anything. So I'm sure it's just a lip balm. And then let's see. Looks like a lipstick in the shade 127. Let's see what it looks like. Whoa. Hmm. We'll see what it looks like on my lips. I don't know if I like that or not. And then Came with mascara. I got all kinds of stuff. Let's see. This is Sumptuous Extreme Lash Multiplying Volume Mascara. And it's like they're little mini sizes, but holy wand. That thing looks enormous. Dang, I need to try that out. And then I also got. Estee Lauder Day Wear Multi Protection Antioxidant 24 Hour Moisturizer Cream. This has SPF 15. So, this might be good to put on like before my makeup. Mmm, sm smells good. It smells. Has that sunscreen smell, but it has like a fruity sunscreen smell. <laughs> and cooling antioxidant moisturizer gel cream this looks like it's an eye cream so maybe put this on like at night <clears throat> and then one more thing oh this is night the night wear so so maybe you put this on in the morning and then this one on at night like under your eyes or something who knows i don't know okay and then i got a couple things from bath and body works i got um, a new shower gel, cool coconut surf. Uh, smells like summer, straight summer coconut palm trees. And then I got two different candles. I got this one in mahogany coconut. Can you tell I like coconut? Oh, Cora wants to smell it. It smells good. Mm, that one smells friggin' fantastic. And then, of course, I got another stress relief can. Oh, he wants to smell that one too. He wants to smell that one too. Oh, he don't like that one. Mm. Anything eucalyptus is in my life. And then I have um, Scentsy warmers. So I wanted to try some of their wax melts. See how they smell in my... <laughs> so I got eucalyptus. And then Tiki Beach. Mm, God, that one smells good. And then Cactus Blossom. This is one of my favorite scents. Oh, God. God, help me. Oh, I got another sample from Estee Lauder. Oh, wait. Yeah, guys, I think that wraps up everything I bought, you know. 
I just like to torture myself and buy stuff and then my paycheck is gone and I can, then I complain about not having money, but <laughs> anyway. But yeah, guys, that's what I bought. That wraps up this video. I hope you enjoyed watching me <laughs> reveal my secrets about spending all my money. But anyways, guys, I hope that wraps up. I hope that wraps up this video. It does wrap up this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Subscribe to my channel and hit that notification bell so you can be notified when I upload. And I will see you in my next video. Bye.